Good morning. So I'm actually pretty excited about something that I'm going to start doing on my page. I'm going to start presenting scenarios. They may or may not be actual scenarios. They may or may not be made up just to create a story to tell because I want to know how somebody would handle that. There's no wrong answer, maybe. I don't know. There might be wrong answers, but there's no one answer. How's that? I don't want to say there's no wrong answer because there are definitely wrong answers. Um, But what I'm interested in is seeing how people would handle a scenario that's presented to them. So I'll give you kind of an example. My horse, Katie, if she gets it in her mind, she knows what I want from her. And she's set. That's what I want from her. And it's not open for discussion. And she she will fight to the death for what she thinks is her cause. If I were to fight with her and say, you know, damn it, horse, this is what I want from you. Why aren't you getting it and, and get into that kind of tug of war of wills, right? I won't help my horse by taking up my energy. I will upset my horse even more and she will dig in even more. And then she will decide that um, she would potentially become more aggressive or shut down. Those are the two real options that this particular horse would give me. So what I need to do for her is I need to stop her and be like, it's like, like when a child is really, really upset about something and and they're like, you know, having a hard time explaining that they just saw the boogeyman or whatever. And you're like, wait, 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 explain to me what it is. You know, with Katie, it's like, wait, 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 you don't know what I want from you. Let's just take a breath. And if you don't mind, I'm going to try to explain it to you a little more clearly. If I don't take that approach with that horse and I take the approach of, come on horse, you know, I guarantee you two things are going to happen. I'm going to get hurt and I'm going to absolutely damage my relationship with that horse because she believes that I'm going to support her no matter how emotionally shaken up she gets and no how matter no matter how emotionally distressed she can make me how frustrated she could make me knowing that if I feed off of my frustration I am only going to fuel her annoyance with me right so like it's gonna be scenarios like that how would you handle a horse like her? You know, would you get louder? Would you get more intense? Would you start swinging ropes and making contact instead of just suggestively asking her to move off of the sound of the whirling rope next to her? How would you manage a horse that's getting more and more and more emotionally irritated with you because you're not listening to her. She's convinced she's right. You're not listening to her. How are you going to help that horse? Um, I hope this is the right road. I think it is. Uh, so that's one scenario I'm going to come up with. I've already like written down a bunch of different scenarios that I'm going to show and it's actually like one is multiple scenarios. I'm going to put them in little chunks, but they're actually an entire, um, like leading Tucker out to, out to the paddock and having what happened, how I managed it, but I'm not going to tell you how I managed it. I'm going to ask you how you would manage it. Um, 
and it actually like there were multiple things that happened so i'm going to break them down into how would you manage this part how would you manage if he did this how would you manage so then we move on and something else happens how would you manage that um I'm curious. I'm just curious. And I, and who knows, maybe this discussion could be helpful to people who wouldn't know how to manage that. Um, so that's my plan. And I think it'll be kind of fun. I'm interested to see what people say. It won't be the kind of thing that I'm looking for. You're, you're coming anyway. Oh my God. <laughs> Apparently I was supposed to yield to her. And even though she has a yield to upcoming traffic sign as well. Okay. Anyway, so I think that'd be fun to, to offer and create a discussion. And, um, I'm going to just kind of say in advance that if the discussion turns into people berating each other for their answers or people talking down to other people for their answers or for their, you know, their participation, but yet maybe not enough experience to know that that would really backfire. I don't want anybody attacking anybody else, so we're not going to do that. Okay? Cool. I'm looking forward to it. I have a couple I'm already going to post, so I'm looking forward to it. Maybe I'll do it via video like this, or maybe I'll um, do it in writing. I'm not sure. Okay. Thanks. Have a great day.